Fiends Media. Welcome back to the episode of Frank and Fiends, the man Frank C. Um, today I'm going to talk about a set that um, kind of under the radar a little bit. It dropped in 2020, I believe. And, um, you know, it, it, this set is kind of a um, community favorite, I would say. I don't think it's really that known outside of the Fraggles community. Um, that scent is, uh, this, this is the extreme version. This is Mont Blanc, um, Star Walker Extreme. I picked this up at, uh, at Marshall's. It was uh, twenty four ninety nine there. Um, uh, you know, sealed up. I'm gonna unbox it and give, give you my um, first impressions on it. Um, you know, and um, you know, see what it's about. So, um, you know, let's uh, let's open up the box and see what we have here. So, sealed up. The bottom is the batch code. You know, the price is uh, playing the bottom of the side, so let's just see what, what we have here. So, the original um, Star Walker, um, you know, which is right here, I've, I've had this for years. Um, the performance on it, it's a really nice sense of bamboo, bamboo scent, it's like a bamboo type scent. Um, it's really nice, but it's, um, you know, the power is, is definitely lacking on, on that one, so. Um, you know, I haven't gotten much. Well, I, I guess I've had a part of I've had like three years, and then you know, out of my collection, it really doesn't get a lot of play. So it's a nice scent, though. But seeing this, and you know, I've heard uh, you know, kind of uh, mis mixed messages about it. So, saw the Marshall, so I said, Why not just pick it up and see what it's about? Okay, so the bottle, the darker bottle for sure. Uh, you compare that to um, original Star Walker. Um, this is a 1.7, this is a 2.5, so the bottle's nice, uh, it's really, definitely darker uh, than the original, um, okay, same, you know, pretty much same design, the Mont Blanc, Blanc logo on there, so, let's see, let's see where I can uh, spray some of this, alright, let's give it a go, I've heard mixed stuff, I've heard it, um, you know, licorice type scent, let's see. Hmm, yeah. It's nice. Hmm, okay. It's kind of, to me, smells... Hmm. It kind of reminds me of, like, a Davidoff Zeno. Um, a Zeno. Davidoff Zeno kind of reminds me of. Hmm. Kind of old school. Um, it's nice. It's nice. First impressions, I, I, I like it. Yeah, kind of. It, it, it goes a different direction, I believe. Let, let's let's spray a little of the original one. Let's see. Yeah. Kind of goes in the direction of a Davidoff Zeno to me. Like, um, it's kind of. Um, there's definitely some other patchouli in there. It's kind of cho uh, chocolatey. Let's see. Uh, original Star Walker. Nothing. I, I, I don't think they smell anything else. Light. Let's see. Yeah, it, it don't smell anything like. This is a light, light bamboo scent, which you know smells good, but the, the power really is in there. Kind of reminds me of Lalique White a little bit. Also, that this has always reminds me a little bit of Lalique White. It's just that Lalique White is one of those scents that when I, when you when I smell it, it kind of makes me gag a little bit. This is like a lighter version of that, but they're different. Uh, I think they're different scents, really different scents. Um, this is like a. I mean, now it's drying down. I could pick up the bamboo in here a little bit, but it's more dark. Especially dark, it's darker and fruity, fruitier. I think this might be maybe the nighttime version of. Uh, the original Star Walker. So I'm definitely gonna give it a go. I'll probably give it some wearings here, and uh, you know, uh, we you know see how that goes. But this is my first impressions from the House of Mont Blanc. This is Star Walker Extreme. Friends and familiar, thank you for tuning in. Uh, if it's your first time on the channel, please like, share, definitely subscribe. And until next time.